You drop Salty Springs, the actual new Tilted Towers. You zoom in, take a look around, of course, and half the lobby is already here. You get a perfect landing, bee hopping to the back door of the blue house. You check the bathroom, nothing. You check the floor to see a launch pad, more or less useless. Panicked, you hack into the basement bathroom and you find an actual chest. You open it to find a terrible weapon. <laughs> Someone pushes and you get combat shotgunned in the face. Hmm. They always, always seem to have the right one, right? This scenario sounds way too familiar and it happens in almost every single one of our games. Me, you, come on, let's be honest. World Cup qualifiers, we drop in our favorite early game spot, land, and can't even find a useful gun. Try as you might, you eventually run into someone with full shields and a combat shotgun. Some players just seem to get all of the luck. But as much as this seems like a misfortune, maybe even bad luck, there's actually legitimate reasons why this seems like it happens way too much. Epic Games has hit a loot catastrophe and are really taking away any early game competition. Let me explain. But first, you may want to check out our tier list on ProGuides.com. Vote for your favorite guns. You know, the ones you wanted to find in Salty Springs. Hey guys, this is Keith Allen. All right, let's dig into why you're probably not finding any good guns. The first reason. May 9th, 2019 will go down in Fortnite infamy. Yes, you know this day. It was the day Epic Games decided to vault the pump shotgun. Everyone's favorite gun and the best gun in the game was vaulted without any warning. <laughs> Just like that, the Fortnite meta was turned upside down. That's the pump. Give me that. Oh, that's gonna feel so good. This is gonna be good, dude. Dude, the pump deals just as much damage as the new shotgun. Just saying. Sure, Epic certainly tried to replace the pump shotgun. They added a new shotgun called the combat shotgun and buffed the tactical shotgun. While the combat is definitely a good gun, the tack buff seems to just fall flat on its face. It still just doesn't do enough damage, even when you're point blank to another player. But the vaulted pump started a snowball effect for Fortnite's early game. It was the first push that made the game reach the point where nothing seemed useful anymore. While the pump could have been really problematic for gameplay, it gave everyone a high rate of drop item to go in for the early game. Now we don't even have that many reliable options to survive past a few first minutes of a game. Just take a look at the combat shotgun. The gun is certainly good, don't get me wrong, but one of the biggest issues with it is quite simple. The combat shotgun only comes in blue, purple, or gold rarities. On the surface, this doesn't seem terrible, but you have to trust me guys, this is huge. The pump shotgun dropped in green, blue, purple, and gold rarities. You were honestly fine holding a green pump in the late game. It still did a ton of damage with good aim and positioning. The combat shotgun just doesn't have a green rarity. Simply put, you're finding a combat shotgun much less than the pump shotgun in the early game. You are left to fend for yourself with hopefully a green tact at the least. The vaulted pump and rare combat shotgun were really just the start of the early game problem. The real issue is probably something you haven't even thought about yet. Fortnite's loot table is a disaster. Games usually deal with power creep. You know that. Items that get put into the game that make everything else obsolete. But Epic has forced another problem. They have put so many mediocre items into the game that there's actually been a crisis with what to use. Just look at all the items you can get out of your first chest. Oh, we'll be seeing them, dude. Yep. And we'll be seeing them. Back to the lo oh, back to the lobby. We'll be seeing you. Fuck. Why does this area suck so much, dick? Oh no, not fucking dualies. Fuck, dude. Oh, 
just killed the whole server. Yeah, I need just to do Give me some room, bro. You don't own it. I just don't scrap them. He's one HP. Oh my god, I just killed the whole server. I mean, this is actually ridiculous. I really don't think there's been a point in the game with this many items or weapons available. Let's just do a little test, okay? How many of these guns do you actually want on the drop? Everyone knows you will certainly take the combat shotgun, okay? But we already covered how rare it is. This is his load. On me? Two kids on me, I think. Let's go. They're standing still. They're crouching and shit. Headshot sniped one. Oh, you just killed me. Oh, I, don't, I don't know. Like, maybe you should come. I've got 100 mats. It's going to get a res. I'm going to have like, no mats. They're going to get the kill still. Yeah, mate, just leave me. Just leave me. I'm chilling. Then there's just a significant drop off. Sure, the tactical AR is pretty good, but it actually just feels like a worse SMG. Yes, you'll probably take the drum gun, but even your favorite spraying weapon has rarity issues. The last two you maybe want would be any classic AR and, oh my goodness, the tact, I guess. Everything else is basically too rare or an actual meme. <laughs> So yeah, these options certainly aren't the best. Clearly, Epic Games has diluted their pool a bit too much. The best gun in the game is too rare to find, and you're basically hoping for a good drop every single time. This also makes the combat shotgun nearly broken, even if the gun isn't as good as the pump. This also makes the combat shotgun nearly broken, even if the gun isn't as good as the pump. The combat shotgun is just so much better than every other option. The one player that gets one in a landing spot should dominate. Look, I know this is a battle royale, and not everyone can get a fantastic drop. I do. I get it. Really. Every single time I get a combat shot off the drop, I am truly grateful. <laughs> but this has just gone way too far. Not everyone makes it to the late game where you can just run to your ideal loadout. I mean, sometimes you're just going to roll with the tack the entire game. Hopefully Epic hears our pleas and recognizes they have a loot problem. And adding in more guns is not to be the answer. What they really need to do is they just need to vault some of these lower tier items and give us a usable SMG. Then maybe, just maybe, everyone will feel like they have a chance in the early game. There is a tiny bit of good news though. In patch 9.30, Epic Games vaulted the Boombo, Dynamite, and wait for it, the Dual Pistols. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go with baby steps, but at least the pool is a little less diluted. If more useless guns and items are vaulted soon, the early game might actually be fun again. <laughs> oh, I'm the best player in the game. Holy shit. <sighs> hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Once again, this is Keith Allen, and stay tuned for more videos coming out.